The approach for the control of spiders in domestic situations looks like this. The objective is to control existing spiders and prevent pest harbourage. OK, Nev, we, um, we might go to the next step now and, and talk about what we're going to actually do. Um, I see uh, we've got a bucket of Coupex here um, for spider control. What are we going to do with that? Um, probably nothing, Jeff. I might sit on I'm it. I'm lunch. relieved about that, but yeah. <laughs> Uh, you don't put dust out in the open air and it blows everywhere, useless does nothing. Uh, you may put it in a few uh, chamfer board home where you see, you see the big spider webs there, but I'd still use liquid for that. So I'd probably leave that uh, in my vehicle. Go straight in with your liquid only. Yep, well that sounds like a good treatment already. The treatment for spiders external walls, gutters, feeding, sills, like they're, they're, they're external areas and that's where you have to concentrate your treatment. Yep. And that's when you use your tempered. Yep. Uh, with, with a wand to get into those little cracks and crevices where they are, a broadband spray or brickwork, so feeding, guttering, sills, extensions, you, you get extensions to get your, your product up there. The good thing about uh, tempered is you don't need to hose the house down. Yeah. It's the last thing you do with tempered is start hosing it down. Hmm. Uh, you may with other, other products perhaps, but no, not tempered, you, you just use it sparingly. Uh, not sparingly, but do the job without wasting it, particularly with cracks and crevices. Yeah, well, uh, that's the thing, Nev. Uh, when, when you use a product like tempered where you've got confidence, you put it only where you need to put it. With, with products where you haven't got that level of confidence and you, you're not paying so much for the product, you tend to put a lot out and you, and you waste all the savings that you've made.